Ooh, good morning, guys. It is noon. We haven't gotten out and done anything. We're having electrical problems in the house now. The landlord's gonna replace a main breaker. Keeps heating up for some reason. The lights went out once. But it didn't trip the breaker, it's weird. So hopefully they can fix that. So I'm gonna run to the dump while he's going to get a new break, new main breaker. We are gonna go get soil um, so we can um, do at least one aeration today. It stinks, it's gonna push behind. Not that I wanna deal with this, but <clears throat> we don't have to fix it. They're gonna fix it. But I kind of like to be around when they're working on the house. So I'm gonna run to the dump. Rachel's gonna stay here. I'm gonna go get soil. If we can get the aeration done a couple mows, that won't be too bad, but we'll keep you guys updated. Whew, good afternoon, boss. Good afternoon. I don't have my head wrap on yet. Yeah, we didn't. Oh, I'm sorry. No, that's okay. We that's didn't fine. start until this afternoon because of the electrical problem I had mentioned. He yeah. Put, he put a new breaker in. It seems to be fixed now. We're just going to have to watch it. Yeah. So, so a new main that's... breaker he put in. I didn't want to leave the kids and and then, you know, have something happen that... I mean, they know where everything is in case of an emergency, but... They know they where have a fire... A plan. And yeah. they know where a fire extinguisher is, but I told them if anything ever catches on fire, like if they're cooking and they can grab a fire extinguisher and put it out real quick, the one we have in the kitchen, but if they, like, come out in the kitchen, it's in flames, don't... Don't just yeah, get out the house. Get, get all the, the animals house. and get out the house. Yeah, they have a plan. They know so, the plan. So They know the plan. Mm -hmm. So our plan is we're going to aerate this one. We have a yard of topsoil. So that'll make five yards of topsoil I did in the last couple of days. Yeah, boss. it's crazy. You're right? working me this year, aren't you? We are working this year. And we have a lot more topsoil to do. So yeah, fun, fun, fun. So we are. Great yeah, we're going to aerate sure. these, put some topsoil in the back. Probably I'm going to concentrate all along the fence. Mm -hmm. all them areas and any bare spots and then, and then maybe a little bit yeah, here some here so you guys will see rachel's gonna go in the back and start aerating first and, and we've been doing soil here for a couple years too yeah it's getting better and yeah this hill never used to grow grass no um and then this would be a hot spot that would dry up so yeah so now this, it's not grass yeah and guess much what better. guess what guys what? No rain for like seven days, and we're going to be in September all the way up to 86. I told Rachel, so frustrating, but that's we got to right. get it done. Yeah, we're just going to roll with the bunches, yeah. roll with it, and hope and we get some rain. Yeah, so let's go. All right, let's go. Okay, so here's the one we're doing. You guys seen me mow this last week, or no, not last week, a couple days ago. Look, see, all the weeds are dying, all the weeds dying. So Rachel's gonna go aerate the backyard first. Look guys, that is a writing spider. Really cool, right? So Rachel's aerating this one, I'm throwing food down. Okay guys, here's the fun part. I'm gonna move all this soil, most of it, to this backyard where we have our problem area. So I will, I think it's just the way my phone is. So what I'm gonna do in this backyard is I'm gonna dump the soil here. I'm gonna dump the soil all up here and I'm gonna rake it that way and make it fill in all the bare spots. So let's get it going.
Okay, there you guys go. I did one whole yard of soil back here. <clears throat> Could have used probably two yards, you know, but okay, I have to go spread the fertilizer now. Okay. You can you blow off behind me, boss. Yep, I will do that. Okay, guys, another one done. What's that, the fifth or sixth? I don't even know. I'm starting to lose count. Well, we did Joe, Richards too, and then Ursula, David, and Doug, and then this one, seven. 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 Wow. Nice. And if we do Saturday and Monday, that'll knock out ten more. Yeah, a lot more, right? Yeah. Did you guys like that one? That was long. So as you've probably seen, Rachel probably went over that three or four times. I went over the front three times. Um, this one, I looked at it, we haven't been here in 18 days. And it is like a 10 day account. Um, we've been doing it like 10 to 12 days because it hasn't grown much, but we got all that rain, so. She texted us asking if we were going to come and mow. It was getting a little shaggy. And we said, yeah, we'll be there today or tomorrow. We decided to do it today. Um, we just explained to her that we were behind. 
because we're doing aerations and they take longer. And she texts back. And she said, oh, I think my lawn needs that. Can you give me a quote? So we're gonna send her over a quote. See, as long as you communicate with your clients, they're not gonna be too uh, unhappy for the most part. Um, but let's go ahead and get done. Everything's going to seed. So Wes, if you uh, know Ratliff's Lawn Care, if not, guys, go subscribe to them. They're almost at a 1,000. Um, he was saying that he came back and the grass grew faster because it was warmer out. I think it, what happens is, just like this lawn, like this lawn, it goes to seed head. And when that happens, because of the weather, it's gonna start changing the fall. The grass goes to seed head, or in his case, probably a lot of cra crab grass, Dallas grass, and stuff like that. It goes to seed head, and then next thing you know, um, it grows twice as fast. It gets the stalks on it, the real tall stalks on it. You can't tell in this yard too much, but there is seed head all in this yard. But let me see. I cut it all down. Nobody's going to have any. You ran out of gas? But those are some pretty flowers in that garden. The zinnias? All of them. Yeah, the zinnias. Like, she has a couple that are, like, look at these. Yeah, look at the... They're so pretty. Look at the spider plant. That There's is really pretty. Really, 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 really pretty. Okay, I'll gas you up. Okay. So as I was... Rachel ran out of gas. So as I was saying, Wes, when the grass goes to seed has it shoots up stalks and they're, they grow a lot faster than the regular blades of grass do, especially this time of year. So that's probably why it looks thicker and it's actually harder to cut. Um, we went over this four times because we were behind on this lawn, like I explained, and we don't charge the client anymore. To go over the lawn four to three times, I'll actually see, I recorded Rachel the whole time, we'll see how long it took. So 40 minutes. By the time Rachel's, it's 37 minutes now. By the time she's done blowing off, um, it'll be 40 minutes. So not bad. And if you're wondering, we do 65 for this one. And normally we get it done in probably 32 minutes. It only takes an extra five to seven minutes to go over it one more time. So let's go ahead and get out of here. Huh. Not that sunny, so... No. So you've seen how uh, long that last one was. Oh my gosh, you guys. I explained to them why you went over it so many times. That we don't charge anymore. It was our fault. We were at 18 days on that one. I guess because all the rain we got. Put, yeah. Put that seed grass. I explained to them about seed grass too. Because Wes had mentioned how the lawn seemed like they shot up more. It's thicker and longer because of the seed grass. It shoots up higher than the... So that and, and any type of like creeping bent grass um clover is also terrible to mow when it's long and wet and her backyard is very wet oh yeah i've seen that yeah so um and it's been days since five days we, since we've had, we've rain. had rain but it yeah i mean just crazy so on the bright side we got seven aerations done we did the one today we got some mode so we made the best of the day um mm -hmm. we're a little behind in mowing but we're gonna catch up and then get back to aerating we have all day saturday and monday we have a lot probably 10 or 10 or 12 all together in them two days yeah it's gonna be big days they're yeah. gonna be big days but so we usually don't work on saturdays but we are now so. yeah well we just have to these are very time sensitive you know, like, we want to take advantage of the nice weather, um, and I don't, like, I think I remember last year, all of a sudden, boom, winter was here. Like, there was no in-between. Yeah. It was... Now, it didn't get super cold. It was just, free. we had freezing temperatures and stuff. Yeah, and but it was, I believe i remember even i'm gonna have to go back and look that's the good thing about definitely recording videos yeah we were looking at lawns that we did a couple years ago yeah three years ago to um see to difference. see the improvement and see how they're doing better and stuff like that mm -hmm. but um i think i remember leaves all falling at once last year now this year so. we're our goal is to 
finish two weeks before we finished our last aeration last year. Yeah. That would be nice. To, it would be really nice if we get them all done by the end of September. We didn't do that last year. So. Yeah. That would be good. So, well, there's always, because I think we also, the same thing, we got really dry again last mm -hmm. year. So. Yeah. So. Oh, I don't know, you guys. I, you know, you wish that you could control the weather. We just can't. I know. I wish <laughs> I could control it the rain every other day at one o'clock in the morning till four o'clock in the yeah, morning that would and be that would lovely. be good right yeah that'd be lovely oh so, but uh, can't so, control the rain or this um uh, can't we control any of that <laughs> no. hopefully not that no rain no snow no nothing <laughs> yeah. so hopefully we get a lot of snow this year but so guys thanks for watching please like comment share and subscribe and be happy or at least try have a good have night, a good night.